In this episode, we'll talk about the resurrection of Gothic Beauty magazine and their exciting new offer of a beauty box. Stick around to find out more. Greetings, spooky people. Welcome to Project Raven. If this is your first time here, please consider subscribing because we got a ton of cool stuff coming up. And uh, welcome back to everybody that's been subscribed. We are growing pretty good. We got like 88 subscribers, somewhere around there, which is pretty awesome. And of course, the wonderful Duchess is back to help you with this video. Thank you, Raven. Today, we got something really cool, something near and dear to both of our hearts. Um, Gothic Beauty Magazine. Um, if you've been around the scene for a while, you've probably heard of it, but if you haven't been, uh, hopefully you'll find it cool as we did. Uh, yeah, so I don't know about you, but I remember back in the day when we used to actually go to these things called bookstores and pick up our our magazines like in the early 2000s, right? Is, is that how you got it? I think that's how you got it. I too. bought mine at Hot Topic. They actually had... Oh, really? Had, Hot Topic? Yeah, over. they had editions of it at I Hot Topic. I forgot about yeah. that. That's how old we oh, are. Wow. Like that's right. Elder goths yes, here <laughs> from the early 2000s. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I think of mine was Barnes and Noble, maybe, or one of those, something like that. I used to pick up a magazine called 2600, which is a hacker magazine. Then I'd get the Gothic <laughs> Beauty magazine at the same time. It was just a, just a thing I did, a routine I had. Um, but, um, yeah, so they uh been around since the early 2000s. They up until recently had 51 issues of it and then they kind of paused the magazine for a little bit um and now they're back with uh issue 52 and a cool new offering of a beauty box which we're gonna unbox here in a little bit so uh so what do you know about the uh, the new offerings that they have with this resurrection of gothic beauty magazine uh, issue 52 is available as a single digital issue at $7.99. A single print issue is available for $14.99 for those of us that still love our print media. Uh, the box itself uh, is sold out and it comes as a single box with the print magazine, a digital download in the box for $45. Or you can get a subscription to the box, um, which is the box itself, the print magazine, a digital download, and you get four of them each year or each quarter. It's $180. These are all um, supporting small businesses. They're 100% vegan and cruelty-free cosmetics, which is very important to me. Um, and the typical box retails over $100. So, Raven, what's in that box? Yeah, definitely. It sounds very cool. I was very excited to see this new offering. It's kind of an innovative way to go to the magazine and then kind of the beauty box. We all of our little surprises and spooky things so is i know subscription boxes are kind of a growing thing so it's kind of cool to see um so we haven't opened the box yet this is literally the first time we're seeing this stuff so it's a live reaction it's, it's kill it was killing me not to open it when it came in the mail i can't believe <laughs> but i you i got did through it. it i can't believe um, it i did look at the magazine though because i got you know the digital version like we said it comes you can just see like see it on your ipad um or, you know, any device you want. It's cool. That's kind of my way I like to read things is, you know, digital on the iPad. But I do love the print magazine, too. So, um, yeah, so definitely what are some, exciting time. What are some of the highlights of this edition in the magazine? Yeah, so they like, do have... Um, they do have some like reviews of some bands. They got some uh, beauty products they reviewed in here. Um and stuff like that so like here you can see it. it's like on the cover some of the highlights lots of gorgeous photography yeah, so. if i remember those magazines correctly uh -oh. yeah the, the photography is top notch it's beautiful it's for that alone it's worth it <laughs> so let's see this box let's do it yeah for sure let's do it all right so this is what the box looks like just uh black box and of course i covered up my address because i don't need people coming over no here creeps. <laughs> <laughs> no creeps no creeps now yeah all right so it is sealed and uh, yeah, so... how exciting i know it's like i almost don't want to do it because i know <laughs> there'll be more like there'll be more boxes <laughs> 
It's like three more to review, right? So, alright. Uh, I'll try, I don't, I'm not look at it yet. So, it's uh, ready. Look at that. Holy shit. Yeah, so there we go. It's got the, of course, the beautiful print magazine on top. I do have a nostalgia for the print, too. It's like, even though I do prefer reading on the iPad, it's just. I will Something always about it, be right? a print person. Like, I cannot even finish a book yeah. on an e-device. I just cannot do it. Yeah, exactly. It's beautiful. And they're collectible. I wish they still had all my old ones, but, you know, I'll try and rebuy them. But, yeah, it's like the beautiful photos and stuff. It's just, whoops. It's like that. And, you know, beautiful. Definitely highly recommend the print, of course. All right. So let's see what we got here. All right. There's a little paper thing we'll look at later. I don't want to ruin the surprise. So let's see. The beautiful spooky packaging. All right. All right look at that. I'll look at purple. Oh, my aesthetic. <laughs> all right. So, all right. So we got a. Oh, I'm getting blurry. So I got a Goth Beauty sticker. Nice onk. Nice onk on there. Mm hmm exactly. It's cute. It's, uh, oh, cool. Let me, uh, so it's a... The Cemetery Soap. Cute. Oh, that's, that's cool. It's a I little tombstone? Soap. I love soaps. A little tombstone. Oh, uh, how does it smell? Let's see. It's a real subtle smell. A little bit of a floral hint. No, it smells really good. Ooh. I'll definitely enjoy that. I love soaps too. Yes. All right. And this we got, let's just say, uh, looks like a little black lipstick. So, <laughs> there it is. Black lipstick. Liquid lipstick. Is it matte? Don't know if it's matte. Oh, we'll have to play with it later and see. Do a swatch on your hand, it's cool. maybe. The swatch, yeah, let's see. Let's see what's right here. It's a good call. All right, let's see. All right, so we got there. Yeah, should be good. Always looking for a good black, you know, lipstick, right? Is it a full size? It is. It's not as like a sample, a little tiny one. It, it's it's a little bit bigger. Okay. Uh, I wouldn't say it's like a full like a full size. Like, it's probably a mid sized one. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen one that it's size. Good for your purse. Kind yeah, of cool. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Can never have too many lipsticks, right? Never. <laughs> no. All right. It's cool little necklace brooch thingy. It's Ooh. Little... Oh, a raven. Oh. Yes. Of course, I like that. I knew you would. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> All right. Let's see what other... oh, what's this? Oh, this looks eyeshadowy. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what we got. So. Oh, what? Uh, Lashy doodle. Lashy doodle. Okay. Ready? Let's see what we got. Ready? Ooh. Ooh. Are those all eyeshadows? Are they are. Look, there's some metallic ones in there. Those are gorgeous. Look at those things. Are they more red wow, or those are pretty. pink or it's hard to see on my side? <sighs> oh yeah, right. Yeah, they're they're reds. Oh wow. I'd say they're reds. Reds are amazing because you can't even find red eyeshadows hardly at all. You know you're right, you really can't. Yeah. Yeah, those are great. That's yeah. that's really nice. Oh wow. Those are beautiful. How many colors are there? I don't know. There are good question. There are Let's see if I can do basic math here. <laughs> you got this. <laughs> 18. Wow, that's pretty good. That's that's pretty good, yeah. right? Yeah. So it'd be fun to play with that later. <laughs> cool, cool. It's uh, hard to open little bags with long nails, as you well know. Let's see. Let's go here. All right. Okay, oh, a little, uh, little, little bat ring. Yeah. Yes. Love our bats, don't we? <laughs> of course, always. Always. Oh, well, it's still a bunch of stuff in here. All right, so what do we got here? 
Looks like a eyebrow pencil. Maybe? Ooh. Uh, nice. Open it here. Oh, it's a stamper. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. What's the design? There we go. It's a, a unk. Yes, that's not ah, yeah, that's, that's so cool. cool. Wow, it's I've never seen one like on that, side. like that shape. I've seen like right. the basic ones, but that's great. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I gotta get the crescent moon one. Mm -hmm. I've never seen an unk, and it's also got a um, eyeliner. Oh, that's so cool. Great. So that is nice. It's different, you know. All right, so we got a lashydoodle.com brush. It's got a, one's got a really fine point. On it Ooh, there. for eyeliner. Nice, thicker one. Yeah. Yeah. For Ooh, very nice. Yes. It's always useful to have one of those. Cool, cool. And, ooh. All right. I think this is the last item in here. Ah, very cool. So, some beautiful witchy. Ooh. Candles? candles? Are those like the handmade? Yeah. They do. They really are neat. Black those candles. Beautiful. Yes. Very nice. Very cool. So, that is our box. Definitely some cool stuff in there and how, well worth the money, right? How many items was and that? Here's the, that is, that's a good question. Let's see if we got two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten items. Very so cool. That's not bad. Yeah. And I'll show you guys this so you can pause it and read the table of contents thingy there. So, yeah. Yes. <clears throat> so, I'll let you guys read that. But yeah, I got the brands in here and everything so yeah take a peek at that and like i said supporting small business they're all uh, cruelty free you know all wonderful things vegan so. cruelty free very important vegan yeah so i think it's a win i'm definitely glad subscribe to it and i'll be excited to see the next guys... boxes too yeah i kind of see where they're going and if they have like themes yeah. or what it is because we really don't know yet so um, but yeah, if you guys are interested, I would subscribe to them because they do sell out and there's a time limit from when you can order them because once they start shipping, you can't get them. How many did they sell? Did it say anywhere online? You know what? That's a good question. I don't think they said how many. Yeah, but very cool. Sold out. So That's pretty great. So yeah, does... we're not the only ones that thought it was a good idea. <laughs> does this mean that Gotham Beauty Magazine is back? It is, yeah. Like, so they're going to be good. continuously publishing. Very nice. Hopefully, because <laughs> God is picking up. You know, it seems lately, right? So, yeah. It's always been cool, here, cool. in my opinion. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so, what would you think? Was it a, a good deal? Good? Did you like I it? I thought it looked pretty great. I mean, you bought the the subscription for one hundred and eighty dollars, yep. and you're going to get four of those boxes. I mean, everything seemed really nice. It looked like it was packaged really nice. Yeah, I think it was a pretty good, you know, treat yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's something to look forward to, you know, so, yeah. Yeah, I'll be, I could send you a couple things from it, you know. Hey, anything you don't want to use, I'll take. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. So Gothic Beauty uses the platform called Zinetastic. Uh, it is a small independent company that specializes in alternative type magazines, which is really cool to see someone specializing in our world and related things. Um, so on the site, you'll be able to buy the digital subscription or download your copies that you bought and uh, subscribe to the beauty boxes, all that sort of thing. So it's a great platform. It's really seems like a good thing for them to use also check out the gothic beauty website uh hasn't been updated in a while but hopefully with the relaunch of the magazine they'll update it soon they have some good articles on there like for example my favorite band the birthday massacre cool article on them so check it out we also recommend checking out their facebook group because they do have more recent posts on there and kind of updates on what's going on and they will let you know when the new issues come out so definitely add them on facebook all right, cool. So hopefully you guys found this helpful and useful and uh, stay subscribe or subscribe or stay subscribed because we have 
three more to unbox and we got some other fun videos as we talked about last time lots coming of fun up. stuff coming yeah. up yeah for sure tons of content coming so uh yeah so that's our video for today uh remember to like comment and subscribe uh and uh, anything you want to say before we go stay tuned kids more spooky stuff on the way for sure for sure all right and with that raven must fly and so must duchess so we'll see you in the next video bye